Hello. Today I'm going to review something a little bit different. An espresso maker. Namely, the site is all in one espresso machine for the home barista. I've never worked in a coffee shop. I mean, I don't really know how to do this, but I do like coffee. So I've got that going for me and um, I like cappuccinos. So I was thinking about, you know, I'm going to do this review from the point of view, from the enthusiastic home brewer who wants to make a decent espresso at home without too much trouble. Um, the machine comes with two espresso glasses, one tamper, one tamper mat, one milk frother pitcher, one apron, and one cleaning cloth. Okay, so a little overview here. You can see it has the hopper on top here with a grinder built in. So you put your beans right in here and then you can set the setting. According to the instruction, it has an intelligent PID temp system for more stable and accurate temperatures. Um, and that supposedly delivers the uh, water at precisely the right temperature, which ensures optimal espresso extraction. It also has a 15 bar Italian pump, which delivers the right amount of pressure for extraction and produces a nice crema. Crema is what we all want, right? So the grinder has 30 different settings here. Seems like kind of a lot. Um, but you can set it to coarse or fine so that it delivers the freshly ground coffee um, directly into the filter. As so, um, and then you make your espresso. And I, I must say, um, that seems like a pretty nice feature. I've played around with some basic espresso makers in the past and none of them have had this feature. And I think that seems like really nice and like like takes that away. You don't have to think about grinding separately. It makes it easier, more efficient. So I like that. And so here we have a steam wand, which supposedly allows you to hand texture microfoam milk so you can create latte art at home. I have never done latte art. We'll see how that goes. And on the machine here, you can see it has a touchscreen panel with LED indicator. Um, it has a detachable tray holder uh, and a warm up tray on top. You can choose whether you want to make a single or a double shot of espresso. Let me get some stuff together, get coffee in there, um, get the machine on. I think I'm going to make a double shot, right? So we're going to hit the button. A machine like this does a lot of stuff for you. You don't have to, you know, really do too much. But the one thing you do have to do, right, is tamper the espresso down. Okay, now let's put in this and you just push that like that. And since we are making a double shot, I'm gonna be using two glasses. I'm just gonna push the button. Okay, we got our espresso. I've had this machine for what, like two weeks now or something here. I've set it up here, I have a little coffee station and I've gotten dangerously used to making these cappuccinos and various drinks um, all the time. You wanna push that button? Yes. Okay. <gasps> Let's make one more. I do feel like I am running a coffee shop in this house more or less is this, however. Get your coffee. Go. <laughs> it's really nice to have this set up. I mean, I don't go to coffee shops much anymore. I pretty much stay at home. So to be able to, you know, have a machine that uh, makes it really easy for you to uh, produce really nice drinks um, without much trouble has been very nice. I've been making a lot of coffees, mochas. I made a dirty chai that was really good. So final evaluation here as I'm editing together this footage is that um, it's been really nice. I mean, I am not really comparing this to similar models, but from uh, an amateur's point of view, um, it's very easy to operate. I haven't had a bad cup of coffee yet or a bad uh, espresso, although I don't really drink espresso. Espresso, I like to have it in, you know, cappuccino or, or something along those lines. 
Um, in the past, I haven't really uh, wanted to bother with uh, cappuccinos and stuff sometimes because it just seems so like a little, a couple too many steps with grinding the coffee first and, and setting it all up. It takes a little while, but I really think that that that's been kind of removed. That steps, it's it's very convenient uh, and very tempting to make um, a lot of these <laughs> every day. Um, in gen in terms of the machine, though, um, everything's been working nice. It looks nice and crisp. It's super easy to use. Um, and I, I really like the uh, having the hopper on top, uh, so the grinder is like built into the system. So if you're interested in getting one of these, um, you can buy this on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description below. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna have some more coffee. But I hope you've been doing well. I uh, hope you had a good holiday uh, and a good start on the new year. Um, and I'll see you guys soon.